And that is 26,599 stardust, which is 88 bags of gems, which is a f load of gems. Now you may be wondering why, Hannah, do you have such a f load of gems? And the truth is, this is the Click Locked account, an account where every click costs me 100 gold. Every time I interact with the game in any way, every time I move, click, obviously, <laughs> access the bank, touch an NPC, touch... Bad word, I don't write scripts. <laughs> if I run out of clicks, the entire client is disabled and I am trying to do the most difficult thing you can do on any RuneScape account, a fire cape. I peaked in 2008. And last episode, we left off trying to make money from star mining. I was just vibing. I only have 32 clicks left. I was legitimately just watching a YouTube video, having a great time, and I didn't realize how low I was running on clicks. I'm gonna die not through difficult and struggle, but through incompetence. <laughs> and now you may be wondering, why has it been three months since the last episode and there is only one person to blame, and that is editing Hannah. She went on strike. What? Mate, fuck off. <laughs> what did I do? <laughs> and that is 1.2 mil. And with that, it's time to enact my grand plan for this video. The goal for this video is mostly retribution from that fucking wall last episode. What the fuck? I don't have any agility levels! Our money maker today is gonna have to do with agility. So we need to figure out how to get a bunch of agility levels without spending a lot of clicks. And there was a great suggestion of the blast furnace. You see, there is a little bike that one click lets you ride until you run out of run energy and you get one XP every tick. But I don't actually think that that is overall better XP per click the normal agility. But I will happily test it out. So step one, we're gonna go to... <laughs> one day I'll remember what my F keys are. We're gonna go to the Alcarid agility course. This is 22.5 XP per click. This is one of my favorite naked genies, by the way. Look, Goody put it behind the bank. That is two grand. Wait, 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 wait. This swaggeroni guy, they're gonna get the 200k. That must be so confusing for him. Thank you, for what? I don't know. Bye. <laughs> Ah, fuck off. Now, I'm like 90% sure you can just walk into Kelda Group, right? I th I th I'm pretty sure you can just go straight in. Is he holding a gun? Wait, sorry. Is that his- f Is he holding a gun? <laughs> or is he pointing and he's just got a really long finger? So with one stupidly long cutscene, we were finally in Keldegrim, the home of the Blast Furnace. Finally, quest options that reflect my own opinion. <laughs> no, I don't think I will help you. <laughs> I clicked on the other side of the river and somehow I ended up staring at this wall. Mate, you're going the wrong way. But I am like 99% sure you need to finish a quest to go to the blast furnace. Oh, that's one door, two door, three door. Can I just go down? So if I get more than 22 XP, this method's worth it. Let's see. No. Why don't I just Google things before I walk all the way here? <laughs> I'm so worried if there was a quest requirement, I forgot about level requirement. You know what, while we're here, there is something I do actually need. I felt naked without my tiny, tiny shorts. <laughs> and that is 30 agility. Sync this up in uh, in post, Hannah. <laughs> don't say some fucking witty comment. You, it, stop getting meta with these. These videos are getting too meta editing, Hannah. Don't tell me what to do. I'll delay this video for another fucking month. <laughs> And that is 30 agility. So Varrock is 23.8 XP per click. It's not even that much better than our crit. And the Keldegrim little fucking significantly more. Look at that. Now XP per hour, <laughs> it's gonna be rough. I think we're gonna have to do this for about a week. <laughs> I'll see you soon, guys. <laughs> so it's about 269 XP per click. Nice. But we do have to stand here for 7 minutes and 30 seconds. Um, <laughs> Sorry, I'm just... <laughs> maybe I should, uh... Maybe I should get something in the bank to do while I stand here for 7 minutes. Or we could just wait. <laughs> You know, this account isn't about being efficient. I'm pretty happy to just wait here for seven minutes. <laughs> I'm in a real predicament here, team. I could sit here for 50 hours, which I'm okay to do, but that seems indulgent even for me. <laughs> As someone who often indulges. <laughs> you know, I did promise a video <laughs> within the week, but... <laughs> you know, I, got, I gotta... 
I got a bike to cycle on. <laughs> this is such an extreme waste of clicks. I'm gonna have to spend a week at the fucking <laughs> blast point. I'm not falling to the trap again. I'm not gonna AFK for an entire month, I promise. I'm just gonna AFK for like a week. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> It's just 50 hours. What's 50 hours amongst friends? <laughs> so I've been doing a little bit more research. Apparently people use this pump to gain strength XP on a certain world. So maybe while I wait for my run to come back, I just find a world full of people pumping. And that way I'm getting a little bit of XP so I don't feel as bad just standing here for seven minutes to get 200 agility XP. I am 80 in strength, so maybe this isn't gonna be that helpful. Is this guy giving us coke? Apparently you need to get coke to, uh, to get gains, which I think is, you know, a good parallel for real life. So, after pedaling for a long time on that bicycle, getting around 2k XP per hour, I made a discovery. I was dicking around with the clan. You get one smithing XP every time someone smiths something when you're using the machine. Clicklocked has 21 smithing XP without doing anything. I'm getting smithing XP! I'm getting a bunch of smithing XP! This is my smithing training method. Technically, I could get a bunch of XP without doing anything if I just sit on the pump for six hours while other people train smithing. You better on the click locked account. Hey, yeah, 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 everyone's here celebrating my 37 agility. Yeah. I, I have a new hobby, by the way, team. So one of the uh, members of the punks, Max, so that's why we're all hanging out. My favorite thing to do at Max parties is just triggering the ads early. <laughs> you just start clapping and saying GZ before they actually max. And if you get enough people to do it at the exact same time, then it tricks other people to start doing it. And it's very funny. <laughs> Level two, smithing. It's a huge unlock for the click locked account. I can now do nothing differently. Can I be real with you guys for a second? I just want to be honest for just a moment. I love my job. <laughs> I've been here for a few days now. We are 46 agility. All I've been doing is I just run on the bike. Then when I run out of run, I just pump the pipe. I've been doing a little bit of Varrock agility whenever I get a bit antsy. So that's why I've, I've lost like 600 clicks. But because I'm level 46, I think I want to unlock the Canifus agility course. Just so that I can actually start to unlock Graceful. Because it could actually be super handy in the future. But it will be very expensive. So maybe I won't. So if the next clip is me at Canifus, I did that. And if if the next clip is just me here getting 52 agility, I didn't do that. But Hannah in a few days is going to forget that she recorded this. So <laughs> this is just between me and you, all right? Who knows what the next clip will be? I'm just adding more tension. I could be anywhere. I could even be woodcutting. There's no rules. Fuck. <laughs> that is one priest no longer in peril. You know it's a bad joke when even I don't laugh. Ooh, a little side bonus. I got 11 prayer. That's a thing we gotta think about in the near future. Fuck. <laughs> but I'm gonna do just a wee bit of agility here. Unlock some boots or something. I don't know. Just skip forward. I hear the end of this video is gonna be pretty exciting. <laughs> just, just don't worry about this fuck. Just, just skip forward to the wilderness bit. <laughs> fancy boots got. Not the fancy boots. They are just a pair of fancy boots. That will increase my run regen by... Like... A bit. Um. <laughs> and you gotta pet the dog on the way out. Now we are actually starting to look pretty low on clicks. Things are looking kind of dire here. <laughs> I'm really worried. This may be the finale of this series. <laughs> I don't think we're making it out of this one. <laughs> and with this final click, that is now 50 to agility, which sets us up for the main event of today. They recently updated Wilderness Agility. In this update, they allowed you to get upwards of three to four million dollars an hour. So if I can spend an hour doing Wilderness Agility, we can make so much money that we'll never have to worry about clicks for a bit. <laughs> We go through money pretty quick. So I decided to ask the person who knows the most about wilderness agility and how to do it safely, Elhip. I come to you asking for aid. Okay. How dangerous is it right now? Yeah, it is pretty dangerous, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> also, like, look, the thing is, yeah. the reason we were all doing it and camping it is if we do it in the bounty hunter world with a ton of people, you can all, like, band together, right? So if some scary Max guy gets on you, 
and you're in a clan chat with 80 oh, yeah. people, the 80 people can just bolt him off of you, right? Like, there's only one, but the, it's like a double-edged sword, right? Because there's only one world. Would it be a good tactic if I bring just, like, 100 people as a distraction? Yeah, I mean, it's all its content as well. I mean, people <laughs> will die for sure. No, but then people are going to focus me, unless I, like, change my name. The, the bunch of people strat only works if you do it in World 318. If what? you're going to do it in a normal world, yeah. you need to bring freezes and freeze the person who's attacking you back and then log out. Is that because it's like, of like the PJ thing? Yeah, so like in all worlds, there's a 12 second PJ timer, right? Yeah. It only takes 10 seconds to log out. So if someone attack, if, let's say I'm attacking you and you want to escape. If you freeze me and like go behind a wall or walk underneath me, you can just log out. No one else can hit you. On world 318, there's no timer. Like if I'm hitting you and you're not hitting me back, I can get attacked. Or like, it's so just I'm like, like pretty much 100% safe. Uh, <laughs> what? No, but nobody, if someone attacks me and then someone else attacks them, then they can't yes, attack me. Yes, yes, for, correct. If you want to do it in the bounty hunter world and you have a ton of people, you're. I wouldn't say you're safe though, because all of the, so th there's, there's also this problem with Andy. There's also this problem. <laughs> yeah, when you're what? doing a shortcut or an obstacle, yeah. it's an animation stall, right? So let's say you're hopping the lava hop stones. Someone can just stand above it with a ballista, and they could probably shoot you like three times before you get to the other side, and then cross you when you get off, and all of the hits stack at once. But you're pretty much always at risk. But if I look all ragged, and I look shit, and then someone yeah. else next to me is there and like Justica, they're True. going for them. They might hit that guy. Yeah, that's you know. I just gotta find something. people who are willing to sacrifice themselves. Some of these guys ragging it right now. They say it's not about the money, they're just trying to send a message. There's like 10 of them in <laughs> adamant helms and kite shields and... <laughs> Those are the people I'm scared of. Yeah. So, just... would you would you recommend the, the bounty hunter world? Do you have that? What's your magic level? Uh, 59. Okay, so you're gonna need to do this in the bounty hunter world with a bunch of people. <laughs> 59! It's a, it's a hard 59. account to train. <laughs> I know, I know, okay. So, yeah, you Was definitely... Yeah. So, you can't freeze log, essentially. If a Picard no. gets on you, you're just dead. So, you need to do it... You need to do it in a in a bounty hunter world. I, or you just need to do it in another world and hope no one finds you. So, my plan was set. Operation Wilderness Agility Chaos. I invite a bunch of people as a diversion to do as much wilderness agility and murder as they can. And while all this is happening, I blend into the crowd get a couple of mil, a couple of XP, and get the fuck out of there. No one can kill us if they can't find us in the crowd. But first, we need a disguise. 52 agility, there we go. In about an hour, this is all gonna go down. I have no idea what's gonna happen. I invited a few of my friends as bait. Um, they don't know their bait. <laughs> <laughs> Let's give us 4,000 clicks to play with today. We need 150k to even trigger getting money. It's a whole risk reward type thing. Explain it better, post Hannah. And don't say anything snarky, all right? <laughs> Editing Hannah, explain the actual rules. This is important. Fine. So there is this little thing that you give money to and then you get money back. <laughs> uh, you know what? I won't explain it better. <laughs> Fuck you, post Hannah. <laughs> Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> but that is 4,000 clicks. We're going to have to change our name to something incredibly generic so that no one knows it's me. <laughs> How about John B. Gaiman? <laughs> it is available. Do we like the name John B. Gaiman? Done. All right. Meet John B. Gaiman, a divorced dad hopping on RuneScape for the day to participate in a little event for her nanny. <laughs> we need to change how we look too. Because if we look like me, everyone's going to know. But our friend John, our make-believe character of John, everyone's going to know it's me. That's the most Hanani fake name in the world. John B. Gaming. <laughs> <laughs> we got to picture this character on our head, team. What does John B. Gaming look like? They're definitely male. Um, I'd say they're, they got a tan. I mean, honestly, John B. Gaming's looking kind of cool right now. I wanted John B. Gaming to look like a... Divorced middle-aged dad, but crop tops on men. I think you guys should experiment more. <laughs> oh, I get to have a mustache I've always wanted a mustache <laughs> I'm having too much fun. The wilderness agility section of this video is gonna be like four minutes <laughs> and The rest of it's gonna be like 20 minutes of makeover content. Shave. Give me a funny mustache. No, we can't do funny <laughs> I have to go against my instincts and just be generic. Oh, the, this is the one everyone always goes with. That's pretty generic. No offense Ingus. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm now I don't feel like a, a divorced dad. Now I feel like a cool teen. Maybe that's our character. <laughs>
<laughs> I'm gonna need to get into character, you know? No, I should probably stay silent. I won't say anything, all right? I promise I won't type anything in chat. I know I'm wasting clicks. The fake identity is important. Oh, that is generic. That is generic. But it's not generic enough to say generic, but it's generic enough that it, it's like a guy who's trying to be unique. <laughs> no, I've lost it. I've lost it on the pants. Let's change the top again. <laughs> I'm even clicking in the chat dialogue. <laughs> That's a generic looking man if I've ever seen one, right? I can't keep wasting clicks. It doesn't really matter if we're being 100% honest. But John B Gaming is bored. You know, I'm a sparky by trade. I've come home to enjoy some 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 RuneScape and my favorite content creator, Hanani's given me a ping saying, hey, come to the Wilderness Agility and I could use some money, you know, because I'm only level 89, but I don't know what sand crabs are because no, if I watched on any, I would not say it. <laughs> I need a little outfit too. No, all right, we can't keep. <laughs> we can't keep doing it. So I essentially have enough money and enough clicks for three deaths. If I die more than three times here, the series might genuinely just be over. Oh, this is a dumb idea. But there was a complication. I checked the world about an hour ago. And there were only like 400 people on. Just as I was logging onto the Bounty Hunter world, gathering all the people for Operation Wilderness Agility Chaos, 300 people out of nowhere logged on. Maybe that's just naturally what happens around this time of night, is that 300 more people log on the world. Surely there's not that many people. <laughs> Come over. Um, I'm okay. You up to anything silly? No. Nothing silly, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't come in here, they don't let you out. So I didn't know this yet, but the streamer Dino does a community event that's just so happened to be happening at the exact same time as my little event where he locks down the wilderness agility on the bounty hunter world and kills anyone that comes in. I just thought there was a lot of people there because I'm a big idiot. So I kept pushing forward, thinking the plan was gonna go as normal. I am currently in a Discord call with uh, a lot of people. We are amassing at the edge, we're amassing here. I've got the Hanani account, so that's what people think I'm playing on. But in about 15 minutes, we march into war. <laughs> and no one is wiser that John B Gaming here is actually click locked. <laughs> Wait, so when's the click locked account turning on? Oh, oh yeah, no, the click locked account's not coming. Mm, <laughs> yeah, sure. So the first hurdle was actually getting past the guards at the gate. Do we just mass across the, like, the ledge? Or do we hop worlds? There are groups of people ice barraging outside in the multi-combat area. Okay, 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 no, okay, no, okay, we hop worlds. We hop worlds. <laughs> we are the worst PK clan. We have one person with an ancient style. But it was time. All I needed to do was complete a couple of laps, make a little bit of money, and then get out of there alive. What in the hell is going on? But it was a bloodbath. We all died almost immediately. I didn't really fully think through my plan here, team. <laughs> I sort of assumed I'd just be able to pop in, pop out, have a great time, but things are going kind of wrong here. So I decided to pivot my plan and again, not tell anyone. <laughs> With everyone on the Bounty Hunter world, all the PKs were there fighting, which meant every other world was seemingly just empty. So I decided to use this big chaos as a diversion and just do normal wilderness agility alone. Let's just try that, hey? You know? <laughs> and I'll just play along like I'm on the chaotic world. Elliot made it sound like that if we just fucking go on that world, you will never be able to die. But I can't live for more than a second. You've got such a high skill community. Yeah. I don't even know what <laughs> we're trying game our I mean... hardest, all right? We might not be qualified for this mission, but we're trying. Can you put a picture of my cat in a video? No. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off. I'm doing agility. Well, sure. I'm not here for enter your entertainment, I'm here to make money. <laughs> now eventually we figured out that the trick to not dying is just join Dino CC. But I had already committed to being on my own world. That now all of my people were completely protected while doing agility. But I was still alone <laughs> and completely unsafe. One PK of finding me could easily kill me in seconds. Yeah, being actually, absorbed, being least. absorbed into the... Yeah, we're just part of Dino's <laughs> clan now. This is a Dino yeah. video. I'm just yeah. editing a Dino video. <laughs> this is like a, a, a crime ring. If you want... <laughs> what? But just as we started settling in, Dino's clan left 
and chaos reigned again. Oh, oh, whoa, a bunch of people mass yeah, leaving. They're yeah, all leaving. Yeah. Oh no, people are leaving. Oh no. Now, I had invited a bunch of my friends to hopefully be diversions. Again, they didn't know that, but they also were starting to rock up. <laughs> this is so fucked. There's so much going on. What is this? I don't really know what's going on, and I haven't really thought I through teleported. what's happening. <laughs> I teleported out of the TOA for this, Hanani. I, I, I got yeah. in so much trouble. Don't you love yeah. agility? And money? Yeah. Everyone loves I money. Mean, yeah. Maybe you the real alcohol? agility experience was the friends we made along the way. No, maybe the real agility experience was the agility experience. <laughs> <laughs> fuck it! I'm just blasting! I don't know who the fuck I'm fighting. Oh my god, I'm, I'm dying! I'm dying! Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, George. Fucking hell! Yeah, just slap George, I feel so bad. <laughs> Don't slap George! I <laughs> know, I shouldn't have. It, I... was, it, was, it was the only thing in front of my eyes, and I just... <laughs> oh, I fucked up, dude. I, oh. It's alright, it's an instinct. Yeah, I... You know, I feel the same way whenever I see George. <laughs> dude, I've just been straight up causing fuckery. I've been doing nothing ethical this entire time. Bro, I just got killed by Donator. What the fuck? I thought there was going to be a lot more going on, but I'm just sort of peacefully getting agility. Wait, your whole plan was just to do agility? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was using you as bait. <laughs> nah, that's just fucking cracked. That's just that. Nah, that's, that's actually, I, th I thought like, I didn't even know what was going on. I just showed up to the function. <laughs> <laughs> I want to do some agility, get some money. You know, I thought it would be a peaceful day for me. <laughs> and it's gone extremely well. Oh, I'm, I'm literally like almost tearing up. That's jokes. It's been a good time though. I mean, we're smoking, we're having fun. I got quite a few of the boys here. People in my chat are telling you to go live. You should go live and just stream it. You're, you're... I was trying to be stealthy, you know? I've changed my account name. I'm hidden in the masses. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want anyone to know. But I feel like with enough right clicking, we can guess which one is you. Oh yeah, alright, try and guess which one's me. Now, I may be a lot of things, but I am not someone who will ever turn down an opportunity to fuck with Donator. <laughs> which one of these is a Hanani name? Well, obviously I wouldn't pick a Hanani name. It's no, no. No. That, it, it, was it close? How do you know close? It's, it's an arbitrary string of letters. I, <laughs> there's no way of knowing if it's close or not. Easily erect. <laughs> That's a pretty Hanani name. Dude, as you said that, this person started dancing in full bronze G, and that's like such a Hanani thing to do. <laughs> <laughs> that really is. Well, maybe I'm doing a mind Dude, that, game. That, uh, the best way to go undercover is to stand out. Is to stand out. No one expects the sneaky person to not be sneaky. Which one am I? I could the be mind the games are, are, are insane right now. <laughs> And then there's somebody following me telling me I'm not the real Ray. I, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, maybe you changed your name too. What if you're on my account? What do you guys think about this one? Th does this person look guilty at all? <laughs> Why would I look guilty? I'm gonna get this guy. David. He's dead. I killed him. Oh, fuck. <laughs> hey, the guy in bronze G is typing huzzah, combat unfolds. Even though you said that's not you, I'm still convinced. It does sound kind of like me. And it's like you to just get excited over combat. I, I do speak in old English speak. <laughs> I'm, I'm putting all in on T for tree. It's not. That is incorrect. Fuck, what did, what did I lose? Did I actually lose anything? No, you didn't lose anything. <laughs> oh, thank God. So I left the whole time you were guessing. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I went in fact. Dude, these, these, these are the worst kind of mind games. <laughs> I wasn't even there. I don't even. I feel like this whole thing was just a setup. I don't even know what happened. I'm not even doing it. I was never even doing agility to begin with. I showed up. Dino called me a noob, and then I got jumped by some goons, and then I tried to jump the same goons, and then George died, and then now we're here. <laughs> now, after all that, I was getting envious of all the fun on the Bounty Hunter world, so I decided to hop back and. <laughs> Fucking hell. Fuck, I immediately get. <laughs> Why did I decide to go back to that world? That was a mistake. I think I'm just gonna go do Julie on my own. It seemed to be working so much better. So at that point, I had spent around 450k. How much did we make? I'm gonna tell you now, it's not 450k. <laughs> this was the biggest mistake. I only lost 150k. I think I'm just gonna go back. I just think I've, I think I've just overthought this and then underthought this and then didn't think about this enough. So I don't... I don't know how to feel. I'm just gonna go do a bunch of agility. Fuck it, see what happens. So apparently Jilly's on this world. I want to see her reaction to my account. Hello, Jilly. It is I, John B. Gaming. <laughs> Who are you? Hi. I am no one. I am nothing. Oh, she just said O oh, on Discord. <laughs> I can finally reveal to people that I was John B. Gaming, even though I wasn't even fucking there. <laughs> My name is John, and I do be gaming. <laughs>
Well, I mean, Jilly had the right idea going in the ghostly robes. I should have come as a rock. Maybe that would have been a smart mission here. <laughs> Tune in next episode for the further adventures of John B. Gaming. <laughs> Hannah, where are you at? Who is this Hannah? <laughs> I don't know a Hannah. All I know is Mr. John B. Gaming. <laughs> And then he taught me to meet her here! Is that you, <laughs> Of course not. <laughs> I am Mr. John B. Gaming. <laughs> He's laughing in game! I can tell by the way you're talking, it's you. Do I really- am I really that verbose? I talk in a cool way. <laughs> As a normal human man talks. <laughs> so I would consider that a resounding failure. <laughs> but I did have fun, and I got to live my dream of being a middle-aged man. So I decided to just go back and try some regular wilderness agility. Just nope out of that one. Alright, this just kind of straight up isn't really working. Every time you leave the course, you lose 150k, and we're just... We're kind of breaking even. If... Well, not including the clicks. Without the distraction of everyone on the Bounty Hunter world, it's just... You, you, you can't profit. John, he do not be gaming right now. <laughs> he be dying a lot. Do I cut my losses? Give up now while I still have money and clicks to do a new Money Maker next episode? Or do I keep trying and potentially lose everything? I gave up.